Hey, welcome back to Anxiety Art Adventures. We, what's going on, sugars? I'm gonna show you a package today um, that I ordered uh, quite a while ago. Um, but before I do that, I want to thank some lovely ladies for buying me coffee. Uh, I was overwhelmed with the just sheer kindness of these two lovely ladies. Um, the first one being Diane's Diamond Painting and More. She bought me ten coffees and said, "Congratulations on getting to five thousand subscribers." That is a huge accomplishment. Keep on doing what you're doing. Love your channel. Diane, thank you so much for the coffee. It means so much to me um, that you like my channel and that you want to, you know, contribute and help me. I really appreciate it. Um, just so nice. This community is just amazing. Uh, baby Cakes. Baby Cakes. Hey, Shug. Bought me 10 coffees and said, hey, sugar tits. <laughs> Sorry I couldn't help myself. I just wanted to send you some love and coffee. I hope you have a fabulous day. Love baby cakes. Thank you so much, sugar. Love you. Um, and just so you all know, anytime somebody buys me a coffee, that money goes right back into the channel for me to be able to purchase things like this. Um, so even though I'm on a no buy, if I have people buy me coffee, um, then I go ahead and I try to find cool things um, to show you on the channel. So thank you, lovely ladies. All right, so this is from Crystal Trays, and I purchased this August the 8th. So this took a, a really long time to get to me. Um, I ordered it on the 8th. It didn't ship until September the 11th, and then I didn't get it until the third week of September. So it was kind of a lengthy process, but I believe, I can't talk today, I blame Bev B Diamond Paints for this purchase because she has been showing trays, wax, you know, tack, all that stuff on her channel. I was like, I gotta try it, gotta try it. So, all right, I've already opened the package to make it easier to get into. I hope everybody's having a fabulous day today. It is gorgeous today. I did post on Instagram the weather here in Virginia in September. It's it's so up and down. Like the morning, it's cold. The afternoon, it's hot. The evening it starts to get cooler and then when I go to bed it's like 40 degrees it's it's insane so it's like AC heat windows open AC heat windows open. okay we're just gonna play dump 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 okay uh, let's see okay there's the card this is my receipt okay that's in Canadian money so I can't give you that price for all of this, I'm going to tell you all of this, my total was $30.03. Shipping was $10.01. Sales tax, $1.80. My total was $41.84. Um, so it looks like the gem tack, these two, were $4.17 each. The tray was $10. And then the wax... Yeah, the gem wax was five dollars and eighty-four cents each. Okay, so this company is in Canada, and that's probably why it took so long for it to get to me. Um, but anyway, so we're gonna go over this. Okay, so this is Gem Talk. I got this in Raspberry Lemonade and Fiji Pineapple Palm. Um, this is like a putty. You guys can see that. My camera will. Uh, focus. It's very pretty. It's got a, obviously it's pink and yellow, but it's got like a pearl uh, shimmer to it. So she probably put some micro powder in there. But see, it's like a putty, so it will stretch. So I wanted to try that. Smells wonderful. It smells like raspberry lemonade. Yeah, super sticky gem tack. Okay. That one, yeah, raspberry lemonade. This one is... Fiji Pineapple Palm. Oh, look here. Oh. Is my camera being a bitch again? It is. Hold on. So sorry. So you see, it stretches. This one's green, like a green and white pearl. I don't know if you can see that. So yeah, I like using putty in my multi-placer. So I will try this in my multi-placer. And the putty seems to last quite a while. Right now I'm using um, Randa's Crafty Corner Cherry Fruit Punch. I did order some more, y'all. Um, I really like her putty. Um, and I keep that in my multi-placer. Okay. 
So those are the gem tacks. Super sticky gem tack. Who else has purchased gem tack from Crystal Trade? Let me know. All right, this is the gem wax raspberry lemonade, and it comes in like a brick. Oh, okay, this one's stuck to the package. It's like melted. All right, I'm not gonna be able to get that out. Oh, sniffo vision. Mmm. That smells fabulous. I'll have to cut it out of this package, but uh, yeah, Gem Wax Raspberry Lemonade. Got some glitter in it, um, but it's a pretty hefty, I don't know if you guys can see that, it's a pretty hefty size brick. Nice. All right. I love Raspberry Lemonade. It's like one of my favorite scents ever. Okay, this one is Black Salt and Cypress. Look how pretty that is with the glitter in it. Mmm. Kitty, nobody wants to hear you bathe yourself right now. Skylar. Oh my gosh. Okay, this one I can actually pull out. Okay, here we go. There we go. So it comes in a block. It's a pretty hefty block. Um, and this is a harder wax, it feels like, so you're probably going to scrape your pen. I'm sure it says here. Um, that's for trays. Yeah, scrape the tip of your diamond painting pen across the surface of your gem wax at a 45 degree angle um, until it fills. Yep, press the tip on a couple of trash drills to pack down the wax, eliminate residue. Yep. Okay, cool. Yeah, so that's that's a pretty good sized chunk of wax. All right. Now it says on here. Oh, that was for the trays. I thought I remember seeing somewhere where she said you don't have to keep it sealed in a package. I keep all of my wax, you know, sealed or in a in a tin just because it helps keep the fragrance longer, first of all. And two, I feel like it helps it from drying out. So, okay. So that is Super Sticky Gem Wax, Super Sticky Gem Tack. All right, let's look at the tray. I had to get an orange tray. But yeah, I've seen Bev using these trays. She's like obsessed with these trays, so I had to try one. Oh, nice. It comes with two stoppers. Ooh, that's always nice when a tray comes with a stopper instead of you having to get it separately. That is your that is your tray. You're probably gonna hear Zoe in the background crying. She's looking for Skylar. Oh, and it's got crystal trays written on it or en engraved in it. This is a 3D printed tray. Looks like I got a little bit of something something on the bottom, but I don't care because it's on the bottom. All right. And you got your stopper. Okay. Yeah, I've pretty much exclusively been using mini made trays just because of my camera, y'all. Just because of how well they work. Um, I have quite the collection of mini made trays. Uh, I did give my mom two of them though. So yeah, let's see how these. <clears throat> excuse me. Let's see how these line up. Let me grab some drills. Let me grab a dark colored drill. So we can see. There we go. I'll try to grab this one. See how they line up. Oh, let's put the stopper in. <clears throat> Don't mind my computer. It just needs air because it's a laptop. So yeah, that lines up pretty good. Pretty good. Um, and a tip for those of you that get 3D printed trays and some of them are rough, like are along the ridges and you have some drills that stick, all you got to do is take a nail file and just go in between the ridges and just file them. Same for the end right here where they might get sharp. Just take a nail file and just go across there. That helps. Well, that's nice. They line up well. Let's see how they come out. 
it does have that spout, so that's nice, but I still feel like that might spill. Hmm, no, it's doing good. Doing good. Oh, there's one spilled. All right. See now these are, some of these are sticking, but that's that's to be expected with a 3D printed tray for the most part. Okay. There we go. All right, that one really wants to stick. Hold on. Y'all don't mind my nails. I'm in between doing them and with making wee wack. Yeah, that thing's really stuck. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> uh, with making wee wax, I don't want to do my nails while I'm making wax. Because wee wax is this week, y'all. Woo! All right, so that is crystal tray. Nice. And it comes with two stoppers, I guess, in case you lose one. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, there's another drill. <laughs> All right, so let me know in the comments below, have any of you purchased from Crystal Trays? And uh, what did you buy? Let me know. Did you buy wax? Did you buy tack? Did you buy a tray? Let me know. Um, I do like that it comes with uh, the info and instructions. So that's nice. Um, they do have a Facebook page for videos, helpful videos. Okay, cool. I don't use Facebook much anymore. Uh, they have an email. Awesome. Oh yeah, so you can wash your tray in warm soapy water and let dry before next use. So when your tray gets kind of dirty and stuff, yeah. Awesome. Okay, sorry for the glare. So yeah, so that is my purchase from Crystal Trays. Um, I wanted to show that to you. Here, I'll zoom in a little bit. Um, wanted to show these to you. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yes, because I had been waiting for quite a while for these. So hopefully um, these will work well. I've heard good things about it, so I will try it out and I will keep you posted. So that is what I wanted to show you today. So I hope all of you have an awesome, awesome day today and rest of your week. And I will see you again very soon. Bye guys.